evening um, after drinking. Those are two different questions. Uh, we've already answered the second one. This is the first. Uh, I think the answer to that is basically no. I don't know really what you mean by that. Like, wh what are you talking about? Well, uh, the, the I reason I, mean, I... I don't mean it that way, but... Uh, no is the basic answer, unless you're talking about something where that I'm not aware of that you're going to ask about. The, the reason I'm asking, um, we've had a very brief period of time to weigh outside evidence, and uh, I'll join my colleagues in saying uh, I wish we had more evidence in front of us today to weigh. Um, do you remember Liz Swisher, a college classmate of yours from Yale? Uh, first, on their point about the outside evidence, uh, mm -hmm. all four witnesses let's let focus i'm trying to get this question i know but you, made, you made a point i just want to emphasize all four witnesses who are allegedly at the event have said it didn't happen including dr ford's longtime friend miss kaiser right. who said if she's mark no, judge if mark judge were in front of us today to question we'd be able to assess his credibility but let me just get through this through if i can your honor you, uh, liz swisher is a college classmate she's now a medical doctor um and i'm quoting um, from a recent interview she gave um, she said um, Brett Kavanaugh um, drank more than a lot of people. He'd end up slurring his words, stumbling. It's not credible for him to say he's had no memory lapses in the nights he drank to excess. I know because I drank with him. Um, how should we assess that? She then goes on, if you, if you kept reading, and says she actually can't point to any specific instance like that. Um, the quote that jumped out at me was, Brett was a sloppy drunk, and I know because I drank with him. Um, there's also... I don't think that... I, don't, I, I do not think that's a fair characterization. Um, and Chris Dudley's quoted in that article. And I refer you to what Chris Dudley said. I spent more time with Chris Dudley in college than just about anyone. And I refer you to what he said. In other reporting, as I'm sure you know, a college classmate described you as relatively shy, but said that when you drank, you could be aggressive or even belligerent. And your roommate, as I think you discussed with you, Senator Schobachar, said you were frequently drunk. That, and, that, and that roommate, that was freshman year roommate. Yes. And there was contention between him and the third person. There were three of us in a small room. Mm. And you should look at what I said in the redacted portion of the, tr of the transcript about him. And you should assess his credibility with that in mind. Um, put yourself in our shoes for a moment, if you would, Judge. And I know that's asking a lot of you in this setting. Um, but suppose you'd gone through a process um, to select someone for an incredibly important job in a position. You had a lot of qualified candidates. And as you're finishing the hiring process, you learn of a credible